Okay, let's look at how we're going to add these two fractions. Now, the first thing you'll notice is the denominators are different. So the first objective here is going to be to find the lowest common multiple between 5 and 4 so we can have a common denominator. So one way of doing this is to list the multiples of 5 here. So 5, 10, 15, 20. Multiples of 4, 4, 8, 12, 16 and 20. Now we've found our lowest common multiple between 4 and 5, which means we can rewrite both of these fractions as being out of 20. Now 20 is the 1, 2, 3, fourth multiple of 5, so we need to multiply the top of this fraction by 4. 2 times 4 is 8. 20 here is the 1, 2, 3, 4, fifth multiple of 4, so we're times the numerator by 5. 1, 5 is 5. Now it's a straightforward task of adding the 8 and the 5 together, which gives you an answer of 13, and the denominator remains the same. So the answer is 13 twentieths.